What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Stormstriker here with a new Let's Play for Elder Scrolls Online. Welcome to the Elder Scrolls Online beta. Get ready for launch by pre-ordering now to receive great in-game bonuses at store.elderscrollsonline.com. And I got a guest with me. Would you like to introduce Jesse. yourself? Uh, I will put his YouTube channel on the description below, as well as the website for this game. Alright, let's get in. I'm going to make... I'm going to create a character. I'm going to do... Okay, in this, of course, male and female. <laughs> And you've got three alliances in this. You've got the Daggerfall Covenant, Aldmeri Dominion, and the Ebonheart Pact. You've got uh, Breton, Orc, and Redguard in the Daggerfall Covenant. High Elf, Wood Elf, Khajiit in the Aldmeri Dominion. And you've got the Argonian, Dark Elf, and Nord in the Ebonheart Pact. And of course down here in the center you have the Imperial which is also apparently by themselves. I don't know. We'll see. You think you get that in the Imperial Edition of Elder Scrolls Online. So yeah. He's not available yet but he should be. Huh. Well that's interesting. Alright, I'm going to do an Argonian. And here is the classes. You've got Dragonite. Sorcerer. Nightblade. And Templar. I'm going to be a Nightblade. I love stealthy characters. <laughs> Play them all the time. You know, I forgot to set up my recording. Whoa. You might want to do uh, that. For any of y'all that are, uh, have visited my channel before, haven't, uh, I'll be, I've already done some uh, of these recordings, just a uh, random recording of it just to get used to the game itself myself on my channel so go check out those recordings because those are kind of funny because I'm completely random in them I love the music in this game they, yeah, did, they a did a great job good job with the music this time all right so we're starting my recording as well so if you guys just they, I think they mixed up the uh, the soundtrack in this game by putting in Morrowind, Oblivion, and Skyrim, and Daggerfall music into this game all in and one. And I just started my recording as you were saying that, so what's up everyone, this is Blazing here, coming up with my friend uh, Stormstriker, go visit his channel for his Let's Play of Elder Scrolls Online as well as, uh, wait for the rest of these for mine. What's up, guys? Once again. Yeah, we've been trying to do this the whole night, everyone. Just thing after thing getting in our way. Things getting in the way, dogs barking, His dog and, you being know, annoying. life going around. Whatever. Anyways, let's continue making the character. Yeah, I, yeah it's kind of funny. I'm gonna go with the E voice. I always go with the F. I wanna go with the laugh. Where is it? Where's the laugh? Come on, where's the laugh? What the heck? The sound cuts out sometimes. That's what's annoying. My character's already blazing feet. Creating my blazing feet. So, pretty much oh, there you go. recreated the exact same character, just with something just a little bit different each time. 
uh, for fun, so. I'm gonna go with the Mohawk. <laughs> I like the, for some reason, I like the Mohawk because it feels dragony. If that makes any sense whatsoever. From anyone? So, uh, quick, I think a good tip to go for, uh, for, um, all y'all that think that are gonna go with that mage type thing, is, well, uh, go for that familiar first. That unstable familiar is always best. It's fun to conjure buddies to help yeah. you. Like, uh, el elementals and stuff and like I'm that. Only wearing pants Golems. I'm, apparently, for, for some odd reason, I only like my Argonian wearing pants. Maybe it's because that six pack. <laughs> like, seriously, Argonian's got some pretty epic six packs. You have to admit that. So, am I like the only yeah, one the Argonians too. All right, we're gonna name him Storm Hot Stormclaw. Storm is taken. Storm Striker is taken. Storm Striker SX9 cannot be used because right, of so numbers. Um, so I'm just gonna call me call him Stormclaw. All right, Claw. so all y'all that are on my channel and you just saw me skip through that the prophet. Uh, all the prophet really does is the prophet is just the guy who tells you what's going on. He wants you to free him. And on my side, we will be hearing what the prophet is First saying. Things, I really do you hate listening to the prophet. Me. Sorry, okay. I've listened to it more than who, three times. Who, who likes to? Rush through the beginning to get out there, and who likes to listen to yeah, the tutorial? Yeah, that's pretty much how you're gonna go with us, guys. All right. I really wish you could open some of these doors. Talk to the prophet. So, Lino, you've been through the ordeal. Hurt. Take a few moments to collect yourself. Like you, I am a prisoner in this place, yet so much more. I am the past and the future, both. I am despair and hope. The tapestry we weave is a complex one. You cannot hope to see its pattern in its entirety. Not yet. You must rescue me, and I, in turn, must rescue you. You must escape from this cell, take up arms, and protect well, yourself. Well, this sucks. You can only go then with a boss staff. Titan. Or a restoration staff. Right. You there. So go, go into our inventory here Let me open your and door. select this, or we won't be allowed to Quickly. move on. You must escape so, the as you can see, you can pause the video real quick and take a look at that. All this is, uh, uh, the thing. Quickly, follow the scene. There are Quickly. weapons in the forge Follow beyond these cells. Arm yourself. Quickly, follow Ernestine. Are you the one doing that? Yeah, I can do a little bit of voices here and there. <laughs> <laughs> Quickly, follow Ernestine. <laughs> Grab something to defend yourself from the rats. Don't be greedy. We have a lot of prisoners. This is where you get your weapons and then you choose. I can do the weirdest and creepiest laughs. He's also got a. Uh, his voice is also trying to change as well. I can see the names for this first place are pretty demented. Bleeding Forge. Anyways. Uh, the what? I'm gonna go with the Twin Axes. Yeah. Last time I. An enemy approaches. Strike it down. Alright, so invite your group. He is now a part of our group. If he uh, chooses to be a part of our group, then yeah. Do not slow, Vestige. With the passing of time, it any says that you just walked on. Decision. 
I've been logged on. I invited you to my group. So. There you go. But we can't see each other until we leave this yeah, beginning kind of part. Sucks about this. Jump. We have to get like outside of the building of the first building. After Another the enemy blocks the path. See each other. That's what Dispatch it quickly. Die, Archer, die. All right. I love so these games. I enjoy Elder Scrolls so pretty much games, all we don't do you? Is we have to commit levels. So I always end up going with Magicka first and commit the point. Now it's going to take us to our skills. And uh, I definitely recommend for anyone going with Magicka, uh, going to focus on Magicka, I definitely get, uh, get your familiar first. Always get that familiar first because that familiar is going to be a real big help to you. Boom! Small and dark familiar. You should spawn in here very soon. And I got a tip for if you're playing stealth characters like the Nightblade, you want to go for Stanima or, or Stanima mostly for your for your Nightblade skills. Or you can do whatever you want. It's your choice. It's your character. You can do whatever you want. As you can see, you have an alliance rank as well, and when you start, you start a citizen, and here's where you can put your new titles once you get them in the, in the game as yep. you go in. And... This is where you do your new character skills, which is the, skill, is the new skill tree. This is also where when you, play this game, you can, you ask can upgrade. Person, hey, I'm a familiar spawn. That is the first of familiar you get. So. And this is where you can upgrade your weapon skills and right. armor and journal. racial abilities and crafting. Right, so the journal is mainly uh, for uh, your use and whatnot. Journal. Back is M. Groups. Groups is pretty much just this for you and your friends to play. Uh, friends, guilds, alliances, pretty much take out the blue kazoo here. Map. So. Sorry, groups. Be this. That's so new. Easy. Right there, you can do groups now. Just like I'm in one right now. Let's just show like. And you got your contacts where you can do friends now yeah. as well. Okay. And guilds. I'm not really sure how guilds work. Alliance wards. <laughs> That'll be fun Alliance to do. That seems kinda if you like PvP, cute. there you yeah, go. Mail. So. Notifications. And here's where you need help if you get stuck or whatnot. And yeah. That's your inventory. Yep. Let's you talk to Lyris Titanhorn. And the Good. sounds aren't coming up on my thing. I hope you've still got some fight left in you. You're going to need it. A fellow prisoner. The name's Lyris. What? Who told you to find uh, me? I didn't mean to do that. You're... A strange figure appeared in my cell. An old man in rags. He yeah. spoke to you? What did he say? He said our fates are intertwined. Yeah. That sounds like the Prophet, all right. He's a prisoner here, too. It was very dangerous for him to speak to you, even for a moment. You must think you can help me. So our fates are intertwined. I can still hear his voice in my head. What does he want me to help? Why, what, what does he want me to help Break him, him out, do? of course. Believe me, I can use all the help I can get. That blind old man is Some the only reason, person alive who can help us get back home. Tamriel's a long way from here. I'll ready help you. Stay sharp. This place is full of surprises. All right. Let's go. Get yeah, my middle out. shots aren't showing up. That's annoying. Because they're supposed to be showing up. Be cautious, friend, and start looting everywhere. 
Yeah, the stuff that the, everything you see, like chests and urns. The ashen mines are dangerous. Bottles. Graphic glitch. is the other route out of the prison. Uh, graphic glitches are kind of normal, guys. So if that happens to you when you're playing the official full open game, uh, it's something her. normal. It's gonna happen. There's also professions in this one as well, where you can craft and do things, you know. Isn't it, is it like Minecraft? No. <laughs> All you Minecraft people out there. Anybody who has played the previous Elder Scrolls game, Skyrim, they'll know about the crafting stuff, the uh, professions. People who have played WoW for World of Warcraft for years is a beast that should know about the profession. You know what, what I think about now. those WoW people? Huh. 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 No worries. Alright, so stuff is loading right now. Pretty much these are just people. You can't really talk to them. Pretty sure you can Do press E on them. They won't take There's also mounts in this game as well. The the default force, of course. Uh, I could be attacked still, though. Well, I think I'm just gonna take a look around. And I think there are new cre new things you can ride on in I this and Elder Scrolls Online on your on. mounts. You made it. I don't see anything, though. One thing right. I guess you could say is at the top of those this, towers. If you don't see we need to find enemy. a way up. Magical constructs uh, created by Molag really Ball to guide his vision in Cold Harbor. The Sentinels are connected. If we destroy one, the others but that will be blinded. Is still an annoying graphic any luck, that will buy us the time we need to free the Prophet. Grinder. I have no idea. There you are, you We'll find a way. Get your weapon out. We going on a fight, miss. I can't see what's attacking me. That's really annoying. Remember we Fellow Argonians and Khajiits, oh, yeah, I, I say hi to thee. I'm not sure how much damage it would do, but I don't They're attacking something. <laughs> I can't see it though. Feral Shriven. Now it shows itself. You kidding me? Yeah, sorry about this, everyone. Stuff is graphical glitches and game glitches. Causes this to happen. Alright. Seriously, I'm getting like random weapons from all this. All the creatures. I like to loot everything, just to make sure you have gold. You have to sell things. Quickly, yeah, for some well, reason, my shots are to the up, so that's really annoying. That really annoys me. Also, the sad thing about this game, about the Elder Scrolls Online, you can't attack anybody. Just like on Skyrim, where you can attack whatever you want in any way. Murder. Although they do have the Dark Brotherhood in this game, as well as the Thieves Guild and Mages Guild and Fighters Guild. Yeah, all that. So, um, uh. Yeah. Huh. Crap. Missed the jump. So, as you guys see, they hear. They. Instead, when you die, instead. Well, you lose it, your life, and you lose your durability on weapons. I don't think I want to jump that. I jumped <laughs> in just to show him the death, so. So, the bad thing about death in this one is you, your items lose durability, which durability, why would you have that in the first place? That's just going to make this game even more complicated for players. Alright, so, which way are we supposed to be going? I, I really hate right now that it's getting really annoying, because um, I can't see any enemies, so. 
For me right now, it's more of a bad guy. Your fate is with me. Die. Leave me alone. Fatality. Sure. What? <laughs> Damn. See, you can't attack anybody. Have to but go you can loot. Oh, things. wait, I gotta talk to the library. So, Chadwell, we have to find this guy named Chadwell. He's like, it's. I'm pretty sure he's another old blind man that's crazy, but. Eh. You can't steal anything yeah, either. Which is it's very about. sad. They made it to where you can't do a crime whenever you I can't want. See Demographical glitches. Mora's whacking tongue. The door's warded. We'll never well, get in this Well, until he shows up, I'm gonna search random stuff. Why me? Talk to Lyris. Where's Lyris? There she is. I can't talk to any. Destroying him. the Sentinel must have triggered this uh, war. Because I can't We'll need see to find Chadwell. another way in. Cadwell is the oldest here. of the Soul Shriven. Well, for now, after right, years so of torment, Soul Shriven I'm usually go insane and turn feral. Uh, over. Cadwell. He was already insane Some before he left Tamriel. Stuff. Cadwell sees things as he wishes them to be. To him, Cold Harbor is a wondrous place. It's his home. And he knows it like the best. Alright, let's go talk to this Cadwell. Alright, so I am now... I should be clothed. Why am I not clothed? One fine uh, day in the middle of the night. And yes, you can switch from first person to third person. Yeah. Yeah. Each other drew their bows and stabbed themselves. Seriously, I'm pretty sure Cat will crazy. What's this? Out for a stroll then? Lovely day for it. He's playing a Sir, mandolin. Oh, yes, indeed, a pleasure. And fair lyrics. Good to see you, my dear. How are you then? Or is that some kind of old guitar? <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure that's like it's Ooh, some sort yeah, of instrument. Yeah. It's well, not a guitar, I can tell you that much. Though. Isn't it? Tell you what, I it's a mandolin, to probably. In. Much more of a scenic route, rather a fun All right, so I'm in the underworld. Where are you? And corpses and nasty beasties filling up the bits in between. We're talking over Codwell. I think that's a bit rather rude. Oh, sorry. Watch your step. Hold your nose and do mind the traps. They'll like us not be a fair dose of running and skull bashing as well. Follow the river. You'll find the door to the undercroft at the water's end. Once you're inside, stick to the light and you'll find a ladder that will take you right up to the prophet straight away. Do give him my best. Best of luck. Do check in now and again, won't you? Let's okay. go. I don't know. To the Undercroft, where well, there's like, many I'm things to do. I think only by a couple of seconds. Yeah, I have like no texture floating right now, which is really important. To the Undercroft. Like, stuff is loading, but none of like animations, like the. Looks like you found a glitch or bug or something. There. Yeah. It's a graph. It does that. In betas. Sometimes you get stuck while talking to a shopkeeper. This place it's stinks of death bug, and decay. It's very annoying in... Drippings? Really? <laughs> it's a very I annoying. Pulled out some bug, drippings. So. All right. That's a dead guy. Someone got flies all over him. I'm searching trunks and whatnot, so. Watch out for traps when you go yeah, in here, guys. There's a lot of traps around, and they. Spike floors, they will knock your health down. Seriously, the graphical glitches are just getting worse for me. That's and I do believe they do have the pendulum traps as well, which do more damage. There are? 
pendulum traps from like Skyrim and Oblivion, trust me, they're there. I don't, I've actually never run into one in here, though. Let's see, the lock picking in this one is kind of weird. Because if you get lucky, you will find uh, things to get lockpick. Yay! I'm lost. <laughs> Found items. I found some armor finally. I actually got some armor off some creatures, which is really unusual for me. I'm not barefoot anymore. We. Seriously, texture's still not loading. Okay, right, there we go. Uh -huh. Flip, flap, flip, flap, flip, 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 flap, flap, flap. Alright, so Lyra's about right. so I'm at where Lyra's next. Some more later go. on. Let's get out of here. Oh. More stuff. See, I think this part with Lyra is supposed to be emotional. But the thing is that I can't wait to sacrifice her. I'm pretty sure that's mean or whatnot, but I really don't care. I've done this so many times now, I don't give a snot. You can do it any way you want. Yeah. Sure. I believe the story has many different endings. Eh. I always end up wanting to sacrifice. Think. Ah! Watch out for the traps. That would happen to you. Mm. All right. Lock picks. We need to get over this trap. Okay. All right. So. I am a loot horde. I've looted. <laughs> All right. To the prophet's cell. Oh, by the way, for all y'all that wanna, the prophet's like, cage when you be take the ahead. weapon out, Quickly now, uh, when we you wanna put time. it back up, uh, without having to go somewhere, uh, just press Z, and it should put your weapon up. Or at least, I think that's the right one. I've not. All right, let's talk to Lyris. All right. The good news is we made it here in one piece, and the prophet looks oh. unharmed. Now the bad news. It's going to be up to you to keep him safe and get him back to Tamriel. I'm not going with you. What do you mean? Where are you going? I probably should have mentioned this before, but it never seemed like the right time. There's a trick to opening the cell. The only way for a prisoner to leave is for another living soul to take their place. I need to swap places with the Prophet. Don't do that. Don't do this, Lyra. Lyris. There must be another way. Do what you must, Lyra. We Goodbye. You can't possibly understand it right now, but the Prophet chose you for a reason. You're important, and everyone and everything we've ever loved is in danger. Get the Prophet to safety. I'll find my own way back if I can. There are magical locking devices on I'll either keep him side safe. of the cage. You need to deactivate both of them so I can begin the transfer. Once it's done, get moving. The Prophet will know where to go, but he'll need your eyes and your protection. I understood. I understand. Good luck. Message? What's that mean? Many things to loot on this game, and it's very lootable. Huh. Anchor? <laughs> so many urns and chests to loot. Yeah, I, I and of course, a couple got bodies. Special from one, so. Yeah, I just got my first I pair of myself. iron boots, I actually. Be free. I got a pair of iron boots. 
I think I have to do all that again. No. Okay. Bye, Lyra. I hope I hope you rot in there. Talk to the prophet. Thank the divines you are safe. There is that at least. Lyra sacrificed everything that we might go free. Her sacrifice must not be in vain. Can we? Can we find a way to take her with us? Possible, but I promise you, once we escape Cold I Harbor, think if you like keep denying her, you two have to find a way to do it, though. That is the Vestige. name I've given you. You are but a trace of your former self, a soulless one. Open the an anchor morning room, but a boob. It is as the scroll what? foretold, but not exactly as I imagined. Why does Lyris call that you the prophet? And there's my My true name name is lost even to me. Wait for Years all the text of torment have taken their I shall be right back, everyone. Quickly now. Yeah. We must make haste to the anchor. Be your bee. The anchors are Daedric machines of the darkest magic. Their chains bind our world and pull it towards Cold Harbor. I can use one of these anchors to return us to Tamriel. But you must lead me to it. All right, stay close then. I can't wait till this game comes out. I might get it. I may have heard rumors of an Elder Scrolls 6 and and uh, Fallout 4. I don't know if it's confirmed yet, but I have heard rumors on it. Come. We must hurry to the anchor mooring. I shall answer what I can, but no. No, I'm not going to answer any questions. The insects fight back. How amusing. And yet, so very... Hello, Malak Ball. Look how tall he is. Wow. Come, I will Talk to the prophet. The dark anchor's portal is high above us. I will prepare a spell to lift us to it. But first, you must reattune yourself to Nern in order to regain your physical form. To do this, you will need a sky shard. A shard of ethereal magicka that carries the essence of Nern, some linked into Lorcan, the missing god of creation. If you collect and absorb its power, it should restore your corporeal form. I will summon one of these shards for you to absorb. Shard of Aetherius, fall upon us now and anoint us with your blessing. There, quickly, collect the sky shard. Don't worry, we're getting close to the end of this. Alright. J. Alright. We absorbed it A is shard. If we are to return to our own realm, we must act quickly. First, you must activate the anchor. I can sense a dark energy emanating from two devices on either side of me. Activate both devices. I will begin the ritual that will pry open the jaws of oblivion and allow us to escape. There is no way to know for sure. In fact, it's extremely unlikely we will both arrive at the same location. Fear not! I will find you again when the time is right. Now go! 
Activate the devices. Activate the devices. All right, they're activated. Great Agathos, dragon god of time, your children are lost in the fog between worlds. They cry out for mercy. Hear my voice, Akatosh. I require your strength. Let the way be opened. Let these wandering souls return home. Let the will of Molog Baal be denied. Hurry! We must go now! Let's go to the rift to Tamriel. I love that thin mohawk on my Argonian. That's pretty dang cool. One of those awesome things you can do on here now is say the hi to the fellow Khajiits, Argonians, and Dark Elves of the world. <laughs> Hello? Hello? I'm here. Sorry, I'm I here. I had to go grab food. Alright. Um. There's the prophet. Right. As I feared, we arrived in Sorry about that, everyone. I had to go do something. I am in a place on my with the smell of burning ash on a hot wind. The sounds of a distant battle. It matters not. You have awakened once again. It's, it's funny how nothing's showing up on my screen right now. The voids between worlds was both chaotic and violent. It deposited us in Tamriel, but some distance apart, and quite unceremoniously upon our heads. I lost consciousness myself for a time. So where are you in the story? Because I'm not in the world. Your journey must continue without me. Venture outside. Talking to the prophet. Oh, are you like, have you gotten out yet? the agents of Molok Bar. Yep. Wherever you Oh, uh, so you just like now got out. Okay. And they're scheming ever present. Most of this time is for me looting. I'm sorry about that. I'm a looter. <laughs> I cannot foresee that. Not yet. But we will meet again. There is still much we need to accomplish. Alright, so where are you, Mr. Prophet? Remember, the agents of Mother. You washed up and speak right, with so them. Yep, yeah, sorry everyone. I had to go grab food. So. See, I am a looter. I just like... Alright, guys. Thanks for joining me for part one of the Elder Scrolls Online Beta. I am Stormstriker SX9 with... And if you want to see more of this beta... Click that like button, subscribe, share it to friends, and comment below, and hit that subscribe button, and uh, I will see y'all next time.